Well, turn on a talk show or hit up YouTube and you'll find Amarillo's Jacob Isom. He's being called a cult hero for allegedly ending a planned book burning this weekend by stealing the Quran. But the video from that day tells a different story, and so do the people who were there. But did the nation give the wrong guy his 15 minutes of fame? Take a listen. Here you see Jacob Isom holding a sign saying, let's start a holy war. In part to show. And I thought you were screaming that you supported him. Uh, yeah, that's always pretending to get up close to them. Today, we caught up with Isom, who's being called a hero after stealing the Quran David Grisham planned to burn. Grisham, leader of Repent Amarillo, caused a stir when he planned to grill a Quran in Sam Houston Park Saturday. The 9-11 protests caught media attention across the nation and made Isom an instant sensation. Yeah, there's, there's everybody together who stopped it. I think the reason I'm just getting so much out of it is because I, I'm the goofy one that was there, and then I was like, dude, like, hey, the hippie said dude, like, I don't know. But before Isom stole the Quran, here's what happened. Free free honor your truth. You don't me. spit on free your free sacrifice. Hey, you kill me. Hey, you can burn that. Hey, freeze, hey. Well, I'm not going to burn it. Hey, freeze, hey. Hey, freeze, hey. Hey, freeze, hey. Guys, I'm going to burn it. Hey, freeze, hey. Hey, freeze, hey. I think it made it easier for David to give me the lie than someone else. But those folks were not going to let him burn that crayon. And uh, uh, a lot of heroic people around, the, the gal that stood there with her hand on the grill was not going to be moved. I placed my hand on the grill and knew that he couldn't do anything because it would be um, assault. So. How do they feel about the skateboarders' rise to TV okay, and okay. internet fame? The, the, the event was really over uh, when he handed me the lighter. And, uh, and if uh, the other guy gets to be a hero, that's okay. If, if he was getting his five minutes of fame, then more power to him, you know? He was there. He was part of the community at that time, so. Yeah, I would love it if, if Amarillo got the credit for stopping this rather than one guy. That doesn't make as much good news, though. How's Isom liking the attention? When it goes away, it'd just be nice to have a little money from it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, maybe get a new skateboard? Yeah, I might put this one on eBay and hoping to get, like, enough money to buy a couple skateboards with it. <laughs> Some websites have gone so far as to sell Isom t-shirts. He's also appeared in interviews on national broadcasts, and even Jon Stewart on The Daily Show took a crack at him.